Hello to everyone who is watching. I am Aditi Tibrewal, a final year entrepreneurship student at Ashoka University. Today we have with us Vikram and Menakshi, who are the co-founders of Mavi, of the and also the participants of Shark Tank India season one. So, without a further ado, I welcome you. Hi, Aditi. Thank you so much for having us. Hi, Aditi. Uh, so, for anyone who might not know. could you tell us in brief what mavi does so uh, mavi is a home grown fermented food and beverage brand uh, we are into artisanal fermented food like kombucha ginger ale kimchi sauerkraut beet was uh, fermented garlic lacto fermented veggies so our idea is to ferment anything and everything uh, because fermentation opens the door to a lot of new flavors and amazing uh, health benefits that come along with fermented food and that has been our mainstay for the last 4 4 and a half years and the fermentation is quite quite an old technique uh, but in the recent years i think we've, we've forgotten about fermentation and the health benefits that comes from it so how did the idea strike like i would really want to know about the initial days so uh, i was in merchant navy and uh, uh, i was sailing a second engineer and uh, i always promised my wife that i would take her you know for a long honeymoon and whatever so in 2017 we decided for a long uh, american holiday and that's where we were staying with some friends who have who are into farm steading they have their own farm they do a lot of fermentation at home uh, you know the seed saving permaculture permaculture a lot of it so there me uh, me and menakshi on a friday evening were thinking what to have and of course uh, we are wine something was the was on the menu but menakshi menakshi is into a lot of drinking she is not into a lot of drinking so you know we were thinking what to drink because we didn't want to have like something unhealthy soda and cola because anyways you were eating out a lot and you know all of that and we wanted something more uh, interesting and local perhaps you know something that you could enjoy so that is where uh, our friend suggested kombucha and we came across it and menakshi really liked it because you know for a person who is not drinking alcohol it can be quite tricky at times so uh, we drank it we had it over a few days our friend suggested that we could take it back home and you know uh, probably uh, use it uh, use it for ourselves and i said great so we bought it home and we started brewing it at home and uh, that's how the idea actually came to us that we could actually uh, drink kombucha on a regular basis you know and uh, when we came to bombay this idea sort of got us into the farmers market uh, again some friends sort of propelled us and uh, boosted us ki hey why don't you guys go why don't you guys go to the farmers market it was a really good idea you know if we like it other people might also like it and that's how the whole journey started but but actually when we went to the farmers market it was basically it, we definitely had an exit strategy uh, in mind that we are doing it for just 6 months because we have to stay in bombay for 6 months because we are doing our respective courses so we have taken a house on rent etc etc and we're like okay this is like you know we this takes care of our house rent you know so we were any so we were like it's just like a small project that we are taking up and we we love meeting new people we you know so we were excited about that so in our head it was just a 6 months project something to tell stories about later in life right So right now, I assume the six-month project has become a very full-time commitment. Or how is it like? Yeah, yeah, the initial, of course, of course. So in the initial six months, we used to like do everything on our own. We used to cut fruits on our own, ferment it on our own, bottle things, label it by hand, and just do. We were doing it, doing everything on our own. But by the end of six months, we realized that oh, no, I think you know there's something more to it. there is some potential in the yeah. business so we got a couple of people to sort of we we did a lot of farmers markets and events and whatever whatever and then uh, we hired a couple of people to sort of do the cleaning and shopping and all that bit and uh, before we we got into some stores and it's been four and a half years now the first ever farmers market was march 2018 uh 31st march 2018 and it's been four and a half years and it's been crazy like ever since uh lately we've been uh, i have been 100% involved in the day to day operation i handle sales and marketing most bit 
Uh, we've got a small team now that is doing uh, uh, production and you know accounts and all these follow-ups and everything. Uh, and Minaki does a lot of uh, uh, so innovation and uh, the culture, the core of whatever we are, a company, our enterprise, uh, you know, uh, whatever we, whatever you can call us. Uh, she is the she is the compass to our journey. So I have quite a few questions. So first question is from Merchant Navy to Entrepreneur. So how was that journey like? Because that's that's quite a switch. Actually, uh, the initial bit was not very difficult because uh, I had like a I had already decided in my head that I was going to be home for a few months, so it's not going to be a problem. I was anyways giving my chief engineer's exam, so I was going to be here for six eight months, so that uh, I didn't have to take off from my work to do anything aside hustle, right? And it was only a weekend and some amount of time that we had to do. Uh, it wasn't like a full time thing, right? And also because I from I was from Merchant Navy and I am well I'm a careful spender to put it lightly. I I had my savings so that I could you know I could stay in Bombay, uh, experiment with this and you know still you know do and not worry about finances in general at that point. Uh, but that that was five years ago, and uh, so the switch was, I it there was never a switch, like I didn't flick something and say oh today I was sailor. And uh, today, yesterday I was a sailor, and today I am an entrepreneur. It was like I am a sailor, I am a sailor, I am a sailor, and I am doing kombucha. And then one fine day I realized that I have started saying I was in Merchant Navy, right? I don't know when that happened, but I realized that I wasn't going back anytime soon, right? And so that switch happened in in the conversation, and then somehow I accepted it that it's not happening at the moment. Uh, so yeah, now I am an entrepreneur, or whatever we are supposed to be <laughs> another thing that i'm very intrigued by is like how has your journey been being partners life partners as well as like work partners i think i'll just say that you know what really worked was when we started that we were life partners also because you know it was basically like a common goal for us so it was never like acha oh i'm working for him or he's working for me and him giving a half hearted effort i knew that you know it was very close to home so it, it it's our baby and our project having said that i think you never switch off when you like when you work together you never switch off if you're just professional partners then you yes i know so when when you when you're professional partners then you know ki yaar ghar jaane ke baad okay you know i have a life of my own But here, घर आने के बाद भी यार conversation. I think the biggest drawback was that our conversation used to be just around that. So that was one of the big challenge. I think that really helped when we Tara came into our life. So we had like two projects. One was Mavi's and one was Tara. So you know, she really got a lot of lightness uh, into our lives. Uh, the second is I think our working styles. that are very different uh but that was a big challenge but also i think you know it it kind of complements as well minakshi sees the bigger picture she is like ki hum 2 saal baad 5 saal baad kya karne wale hain and i'm like ha wo to karne wale hain lekin aaj kya karne wale hain wo you know i need to get this done today ye mujhe aaj karna hai i see um i also had a few questions around shark tank india so for example how did you plan your pitch because it's very different from a conventional investor pitch so yeah so how did you plan it what what exactly how did that go so this one she wasn't ready at all she thought like we were too small to go on a uh, pitch where we had to pitch right to like investors and be on tv and all that you know matlab it would how would it like and i'm like see life has given us this opportunity that we are actually at this point where we can actually like be on national tv and you know talk about an idea that we think is so close to our heart and everything so let's just do it and she like no 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 i'm not going so it took me some real convincing for her to be on board with the whole idea of actually pitching it because honestly she was also right in some ways uh, you know there was a lot of things that we did not understand there was a lot of information that needed to be there in order to be ready to pitch you know but i said ki theek hai matlab we only have so much time and uh, if tomorrow somebody comes in with the similar idea then we may not get another chance to talk about it right so we just so that's how i convinced it 
by hook or by crook and you know anything and a sam dam dal bhed and uh, i got her on board and uh, once we were on board so basically filling out the first application was really easy it's a very basic information basic you kon hai kya karte ho and all of that uh, once that was cleared we got an extensive one and i remember the most well filling it was one thing of course i had never done this and uh, we did not know 62000 people were applying for it like i could not imagine that number in my head ki 62000 people will apply for it and uh, but the, the most difficult bit was actually uh, doing that pitch video that we need to uh, enter with the application i do you see like a black this uh, this uh, vinyl behind us i had eight of those posted all over the room with the pitch written on it so that i can uh, i so i did not know the teleprompter so you could also do it on your phone right so mujhe wo pata nahi tha us par wo baad mein pata chala so main puri pitch maine us wahan pe likh kar and i kept doing it i started morning 9:30 when minakshi went out for some dog training and when she came back at i think 3:34 i was still at it i don't know i don't know how many takes i did i don't know how many and then i did everything and i recorded it in english and then then she they go okay, this is done i'm like shit this needs to be in hindi so this was just a pitch for selection uh, after this then we uh, went for an audition uh, basically it was like a mock panel and who asked us few questions but the pitch that you saw on tv was then later because they told us that they gave us some parameters ki ye ye information hona chahiye aap kya karte ho kahan se matlab whatever there there were pointers and then also make it interesting for the indian audience a lot of it was edited so uh, you know i remember one of them saying that are ye india ke liye hai to drama hona chahiye <laughs> you know because the indian audience are theek hai business is just theek hai but there has to be some drama so you kind of get that getting that eq not emotional question but entertainment question in, into it and uh, but they also help you with the pitch they give you the guidelines and everything so they, and they give you the time to kind of prep it as well and i think the pitch was really interesting a very important uh, so the pitch was actually 3 minutes long also for the television but they edited it out to i think one and a half minutes or so is like the entire pitch so the opening was really classy and uh, it was very really funny as well i think but they sort of edited it out so like the thing is shark tank i'm going to be honest about it uh, big the platform is amazing uh, as as for an entrepreneur and i'm so happy that we could talk about the product itself mere brand ke bare mein mere brand ka product shayad koi nahi thi lekin pure india mein agar 1 crore log wo dekhenge over a year and if, even if 1% of them decide to try a brand of kombucha of any other brand like any other brand, category of this category itself it is such a huge boost to the whole category itself right the whole industry to the whole industry and i think that is something that uh, that, that you know we really feel proud about it personally feel very you know uh, proud of pr ye we could bring it to the forefront we had that uh, uh, metal and uh, we had that zeal that we could actually share that idea kyunki kabhi kabhi bahut idea acha hota hai lekin aap bol nahi pate ho to wo reh jata hai hai na so lucky enough that we could actually say so nicely and whatever whatever also i think what shark and did was uh you know it pushed us to ask difficult questions to ourselves um and and it also kind of gave us a direction uh that how do we like create a profitable business and not just like oh it's, it's a feel good business, feel good thing that we're doing or a passion project yeah how do we make it profitable and a sustainable business asking the right questions getting that structure together i think that uh basically pre shark tank like before we went for the real audition i think we had to get all the information that we had not been thinking about only so i think that really helped us and also i think you know shark tank pe uh, maybe the funding is one part of it but also what they say is it may be disheartening to a lot of participants ki are ye log aise bol rahe hain but you know you need to be able to select pick the roses and leave the thorns out you know and you have to be uh, careful and see the thorns like see the critical feedback take out the good things hamare product ke bare mein sabne bola 
दिस इज वेरी नाइस दिस इज वेरी डिफरेंट यू नो पीयूष सेट की दो केस भेज देना वो अलग बात है कि अभी तक uh, अभी तक दैट डिट हैपन राइट बट लाइक यू नो दैट इज वेरी एनकरेजिंग बिकॉज पीपल आइडियलाइज अ लॉट ऑफ दीज पीपल एंड दे थिंक की you know and when they like the product theek hai investment business is one side lifestyle is one side and belief system is one another thing right so ye to theek hai but lekin shark tank india really it's a tv show let's be honest theek hai so you have to take it with a pinch of salt entertainment 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 that like reaching shark tank india and being on the tv is not an achievement but the journey that you endure to be there to have persisted through those days when you get up and you're like i don't want to do this i can't do this this is it that's it hai na ye weekend tak dekhta hu agle bhi ye month end tak dekhna hai agle month se bas we are going back home right to wo jo journey wo jo 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 wo jo sab up and downs aap dekh ke pahunchte ho na that is what is important not what what it what it culminates into being on shark tank that's only a part of the whole very very small minuscule yes, minuscule part an important junction but just another turn in the road um i also have another quick round so it's a rapid fire thing so i'll give you a prompt and you both have 10 seconds each to answer um uh, it's going to be easy don't worry so first question is describe entrepreneurship in one word perseverance <laughs> persistence i perseverance okay and pain a uh, second one advice to budding entrepreneurs do what you really believe in it has to be something that you really believe in because that will help you persist persevere and sustain the pain longer yeah see the bigger picture which a lot of entrepreneurs like me especially are not able to see unko roz kuwa ko do pani pilo maza aata hai dheere dheere theek hai and be so see the bigger picture and be like the deaf frog jo upar chad jata hai and people are telling him ki are ye to upar chad hi sakte chad hi nahi sakte he didn't hear and it goes it all the way to the top turns out he is deaf so suno nahi just be like a logger head just keep at it keep chipping it away okay next prompt how do you deal with failures celebrate the find your friends yeah and unwind the friends are the medicine they are your support system friends family but usually friends because they are a same age group and all that friends if you have a social circle social life everything else will be okay yesterday there was this big like roadblock that we hit with something some account and you know i think it was a very very uh, bad day uh, in terms of business so to say and he come from that meeting and he was you know i mean of course it had affected me also but it was just i am more reactive towards these things so yeah <laughs> and then uh, by chance we had to meet a friend yesterday we met them and it's not that you know that the worry is gone out of your head but at least you know it takes your attention to other things that are happening good in your life and then that helps you thoda dopamine ka dose mil jata hai na dost doston se that's enough and probably get a dog thank you vikram and minakshi for such an insightful discussion i'm sure people are not just going to pick up amazing insight from your journey but also it will motivate a lot of couples to start something of their own So thank you so much again and to everybody who is watching don't forget to order their products and also subscribe to this channel so that you can stay tuned to many more exciting episodes that are coming your way